sure we see you later. See you later, Matty. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the Red Men TV. It is player ratings time. Um, I think we've already given the team a 10 out of 10. Oh, thank goodness. Um, trail of thought, shouldn't lose it too often this time. Um, I'm going to start with Alison. I'm not sure he did much, to be honest with you. Um, 6 out of 10. He made that one belt to save, actually, didn't he? Long distance. And it was, from where I was, it looked like it was dipping and stuff. It was a great save. So I'm going to give him a 7 out of 10 for that one. Thank you for the reminder. Uh, 10 to Alexander Arnold. Um, what an assist for that Mo Salah one. Uh, absolutely brilliant. The lads just fucking class to be honest and again first 15 minutes or so I thought he, he was having a little bit of a struggle with their winger and stuff stepped into the game understood exactly what needed to be done you had Gini Wijnaldum going over there and helping him out a little bit um, and he was sound so solid second half getting an assist again it must be it must be galling for him to just watch Andy Robertson get a couple of assists I think on the other side of the pitch it must be so irritating for him because I mean our fullbacks there's no better fullbacks they're rightfully both in the team of the year Um they're the best fullbacks in Europe, just judging on the assist that they get. They're absolutely superb. Uh, 10 to Alexander Arnold, 8 out of 10. Uh, Dejan Lovren, I thought he was brilliant. A couple of really good slides in the area, uh, intercepting the ball and stuff like that. 8 out of 10 for him. Virgil van Dijk, he doesn't dip below an 8, so 8. Uh, Andy Robertson, I think he got two assists on the day. Not watched any of the goals back, obviously, just come outside and done this stuff. Uh, so I'll give him a 9 out of 10 defensively. He was just wasn't struggling. I think we were five 0 up, and he was still pressing about six yards from their goal line, and wins us a throwing or something like that. It's just crazy, and it, like you shouldn't be you shouldn't be doing that when you're five 0 up. But Klopp built a team that don't know when to stop. They can't turn it off anymore. This is what Liverpool do. Andy Robertson epitomised that nine out of ten for him. You know, Alden played the holding role. Didn't really notice him too much. It was probably a 7 out of 10 performance, maybe an 8 out of 10 performance for Genie. Thought Henderson was really good. Again, you know, great assist for one of Mane's headers. Like Everyone's running out of the box. Mane's running into the box. The ball's perfectly weighted. Kerl on it. It's absolutely brilliant. Cop singing his name once again. Um, 8 out of 10 performance for him. Naby Kaiten, 9 out of 10. My man of the match. Um, just so, so good. Like, and he's, It's just such a shame for me that we didn't see this form two, three months ago because... I think we'd comfortably be top of the Premier League if Naby Keita was playing at this level. Uh, it bodes well for next season if he's in our centre midfield. Um, we just look so, so good with him in there. and He looks so confident at the moment. He's winning the ball back. He's driving on it. Uh, he's pulling out great passes. Oh, just superb. Um, so, yeah, 9 out of 10 for him, man of the match. Uh, Mo Salah probably a 9 out of 10 as well. Gets two goals. Um, yeah, I mean, their defenders were just shitting themselves every time he got the ball. There was one like near the end where... Their defenders like waiting for the ball to come in and Mo Salah, who's about a foot short and just comes in and goes, fuck off, see you later, on your arse, thank you very much, I'll take the ball and then I'll run round you and make you look absolutely ridiculous. Um, Sadio Mane probably another, do you know what, I've probably gone a bit too low on these. The problem I've got here is that I think Naby Keita was man in the match and yet Mane and Salah have both got two goals. Keita a 10, Salah a 10, Mane a 10, Daniel Sturridge an 8. Shaqiri, what a ball for Andy Robertson to get the assist for Mo Salah's second, by the way. Um, so I'm going to give him a 7 out of 10. Alex Oxley Chamberlain it's just, just, just needs to get a 10. Was really it great? great? It was great absolutely superb. Like, yeah. and, you know, for a lad who's been out there for so long and not been in there, did you see him hugging Klopp at the end? You could see how much it meant to him, couldn't you? Yeah, yeah. No, no, it's just, it was just so great to see him. I mean, um, the, the reception he got from, from, from the stand, it was just, it was just unbelievable. He's, he's, he's such a presence in the team. And no, no, it really is great to see him. So we'll give him a 10 out of 10. Are we happy with a 10 out of 10? Uh, yeah, I suppose. Yeah, fuck it. We'll give him a 10 out of 10. Uh, and Joe Gomez, 7 out of 10, sort of like that. Think that's everybody? Have I not missed anyone? Hey, it's a first time for everything. Um, there you go. That's my play ratings. Leave me yours in the comment section below. We'll see you next time on the Red Men TV. Ta-ra.